What is up today guys? Hope everyone's doing well. Me and Jamie are going to the retro gaming convention today. So it's the same place as where the comic book convention was, as you saw in my last video. So we're gonna go there, check it out, see some other like cool games. Games. Yeah, expensive <laughs> games, yeah. Hoping to see some Pokemon um Game Boys there though. Mm -hmm. the old retro stuff. Alright, see you in a bit. Here we are at the Royal National Hotel. So this is where they do all this. Oh, there's a car. Oh, it is really busy today, guys. Oh no. As you can see, it is really, really busy. Oh my god, I can't even move in here. Damn. Got some board games. Got oh, Jaws. Panels. Look at that. Five pounds each, it's like clearance. That's it. No, look at this. Dragon Eye. Oh, hello, hi. Oh my god, One Punch Man. Yeah. Is that Five Nights at Freddy's? Yeah. yeah. So many fans. Yeah, but they're, they're legit though. Yeah. That's the thing, they're not fake ones. Is that for £10? Yeah, I can get this for £10. A lap for us. You like it? It's cute. But the nails, the, the head's a bit like... Oh. <laughs> Look at Dragon Ball Z characters. Oh my god, and then I'm not Dragon Ball Z. The film from the controllers. So many of them. Oh look, it's a Mario one. Nice. They have Pokemon mystery boxes. Unless we can get inside. 10 quid. So these are, look, special ones, like cups. Yeah, this is where you can get in the arcade in Piccadilly. So come. Yeah, that's really funny. Got some Pokemon here. Nice, right. and look. Look at the cool those Pikachus look though. I like those. Look, cards sold separately. If you want to get some binders, there's a lot of them here. Yeah, we might honestly. Some. Yeah, especially Pokemon ones. Car sleeves. Yeah, we might. Yeah, a lot of Xbox Ones and PS4. So they have new games as well. And any old retro ones. Oh, that's cute. I have the Xbox. I have the Yeah. So much stuff. We've got some mystery bags. Get some games in. This knuckles have seen some things. Oh my god. <laughs> What's up with the Or he's just high. <laughs> yeah. I know Lucario's okay. That's mm, real. Let's talk about the nose though. Look at the nose. That's not Lucario. I mean, um, a Riolo, sorry, yeah. Oh, yeah. Cassette. Hmm. Use a PC then? Yeah. Mm, I, don't I don't know. I don't actually really know. <laughs> yeah, we've got a whole bunch of Yu-Gi-Oh, Magic Cards, and Pokemon, Dragon Ball Z. Oh, no. we've got an Ash Pikachu Game Boy. This place still keeps getting busier, like, look at it. It's really mad right now. I keep losing Jamie all the time, honestly. It's just, look at that, you can't really move anywhere. Got some other UVA stuff and Pokemon. Hmm. Yeah, so look at these type of cards. The original Star Trek series. Some Batman. Oh, nightmare, Elm Street. Disney keys you can get. Uh, Mr. Meeseeks. Look, oh, Cuphead. Yay. Doc. I used to have the um, red game there. No, man, that's quite a lot. Yeah. It's all wild. Yeah. If you want a pristine condition, £220 for Pokemon Blue. 
Yeah, yeah like his old games go for like 95 pounds for Silent Hill. 45. Yeah, quite a lot. Look at the lights in here. Who does notice it? This guy just bought like. Look at all this. So I want to look for Spongebob, Pokemon and Yu-Gi-Oh games over there. Oh, Jamie fans, Mike Tyson heavyweight boxing, so you play as Mike Tyson I guess. I love how they put the stickers on the faces. Oh yeah. Yeah, look what I found. Space Invaders, anniversary. I overpaid. You overpaid? This is six oh, quid. Six pounds, oh. Okay, here we go, some fungo pops for you guys. Oh wait, this is, is a bubble. Yeah, it is. Uh, this is a bubble, bubble These are bubble heads. Oh. <laughs> is that good? I don't know. I'm not, I'm not a collector. Oh, really? I don't know. That's yeah, this seems to be like a trend. I've been seeing like in most of stalls, like they've been having these like mystery bags. Look at those hats. You want a Pichu or a Pikachu bag? Woo! I love looking at these stuff toys, like you can just tell there's always something that's a little bit off, but it's just funny at the same time. Jigglypuff staring into your soul. Yeah. <laughs> uh, I have no idea what this game is for, but. Yeah. <laughs> Damn, imagine having that. Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtle figures. Look, well, you can get like a framed DS, £60. <laughs> and the inside of it as well. I just thought I'd give you guys like a better overall view. Yeah. Look at all these most, most of them have expensive stuff like collectors between rubbish. Yeah, look at this game. £8 for Harry Potter, the first game. This is the first, I remember playing this as well when I was younger. I remember playing Buzz when I was younger. And that goes for £35. Nice. Oh, what's this one? The Yellow Avenger. Oh, I remember that. Ages ago, yeah. Do you have it? No, I don't have it, though. Some more plushies. Oh, this is cool. You know, you know what? Yeah. Yeah. We are on the hunt for Spongebob games now. It's actually really fun just looking to see which ones I haven't got. We can get Wii Spongebob games because I do have a Wii. So. Yeah, we could do that. I was looking for literally anything now apart from PS2. Well, I'm looking for Wii Spongebob games. Yeah, 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 I'm looking for Wii Spongebob games. Ye
So I hope you guys enjoyed that. That was actually a lot of fun. I was looking for SpongeBob at the end because there was a lot of prices there that were really high, especially yeah. for Pokemon. And Yu-Gi-Oh. And Yu-Gi-Oh as well. So we just went for SpongeBob and cheap prices. And it's pretty, honestly. If you're looking for like some old retro stuff, but it's going to be really pricey, just imagine that. It's going to yeah. be a lot of money. But there's some stuff that you can get there are cheap. So thanks for watching and see you next time. Take care.